Hello everyone and welcome back to Amnesia the Dark Descent. I'm Fratnir and we're jumping right back in it with Daniel being a bit spare and that whole nonsense that happened beforehand. Uh, yeah, after the men had secured the prisoner. Right, we're going to carry on with this and get going a bit. So yeah, all these guys just, you know, quite calmly hanging out. You better not fucking be moving. I really need to recover from some fucking sanity at some point. I am going batshit. Yeah, we're actually making some progress in this. Uh, I totally didn't cheat in a couple walkthrough or anything, but uh, yeah, um, we're actually not that far away. I'm actually not that far away from the end at the moment, which is pretty cool. Oh, oh, oh dear. This does not look promising. Oh, what are my intentions, the Fuck happened in here? Salvation. Someone left the oven on. Yours, but now you Jeez. only seek misplaced revenge. How do you justify your violence? Is it for the greater good? Are you doing the world a service? It is you who caused all this pain and death. If you had accepted your fate and submitted to the orb when you first discovered it, none of this would have happened. What was that? In with your that I don't want to turn around. Work. Fuck. What was that? Something else in here. Again, I have a sun in my eye, so I can't really see. I'm having trouble seeing at the moment. I have no idea where I'm going. Guaranteed I'm... Oh, fuck. Fucking directional noises. Shut up. Rats. What's going on over here? Why do doors have to be so fucking loud? I'm going to have to fucking put the lantern back on. Stop vibrating. I ain't going anywhere near that. Fuck that shit. Oh, man, this is fucked up. Oh, God. I don't want to go in there. I don't want to have to open that. And why is everything fucking shaking? God damn it. I guess I'm going to have to fucking open that. Oh! Fucking shit wanking cunt stains. God damn it. Oh, fuck. Fucking dick. What's that? Hey, an orb. Oh, vibrations got a little bit more intense there. Oh, that was a really dickish jump scare. <laughs> oh, I knew something was going to happen, but I didn't think it would actually happen until I interacted with it. So that one caught me a little bit unawares. Have a bone. Let's see if it's okay, Mr. Bone. Okay. Oh, shit. Well, that was fun. Found a piece of the orb, anyway. I think there's two in here. Right. Carry on. I am still marvelling at, like, considering this is a fairly small studio indie game, just how pretty this game is. I mean, the graphics in this game are actually really good. I mean, I've, like, I've, as I said before in other videos of this, you know, I've seen AAA titles that look worse than this. You know, I've seen games by, like, big studios that have looked considerably worse. And yet, this looks really pretty. I mean, I love it. This is a really nice-looking game. Fuck off. Yeah. And the way they've made it as well is actually really impressive. They have a good handle on what... On what makes a good horror game. They haven't gone for, like, you know... Atypical jump scares or anything like that. And, you know... You're not being jump scared every five seconds. It's more focused on the atmosphere, really. And they wait for the atmosphere to build up and freak you out. Then they hit you with a jump scare. You know, to add to the impact of the jump scare. Because, you know, you can have, like, dozens of jump scares popping up, like, every few feet. 
What's that? <gasps> Shit! Run, 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 run. I have no idea if there's anywhere to fucking hide around here. Not a clue. Oh shit, he's right behind me, isn't he? Fuck, fuck. Oh shit, there is! No, 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 I don't want to look at you. You're, you're messed up. No, leave me alone. Fuck off, run away. Oh shit, I have no idea if there's anywhere to hide. I'm gonna have to backtrack. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh my god. Oh, he's right behind me. I'm gonna have to run in the dark. Fuck it. Ah, oh, god damn it. Oh fuck, he caught up. Damn it. Oh, I can't see shit. I'm gonna put the lantern back on because everything's got red. Ah! Fuck, he got me. Uh, hide and wait. I didn't have a fucking chance to hide and wait. He just appeared around a pillar. Shit. Alright, let's try that again. Where did I spawn? Have I... Oh, that's handy. I have, a, I have an orb. That's nice. I'm uh, actually going to add that to that. Don't need any laudanum. I'm going to take some laudanum anyway. Just in case. Oh, all is good. It's really not, mate. Right. Okay. So, let's do this again. But yeah, as I was saying, um, the makers of this game really understand what horror is all about. You know... Ugh. Oh, hello. I heard something. And the music's changed. Oh, hello. What's going on now? Fuck you, dude. Fuck you. But yeah, the developers really have a hand... Oh! What was that? Stop it. But yeah, the developers of this game really have a handle on, you know, what's at, what, what what actually makes a decent horror game. You know, they they've put a lot of work into like the atmosphere, the music as well, to you know make you feel constantly ill at ease. You know, there's never a point in this game where you feel like completely relaxed. You're always paranoid about what's around the next corner. And yeah, they space out the jump scares and the monster appearances as well, so that it's... Stop it. So that it's not, like, exactly the same each time round. And because it's not the same each time round, and because... Stop it. Because they pace it out. They actually pace out the jump scares quite well, I found. <sighs> Fucking noises. Yeah, and all the little background noises as well get to you as well. Because they'll have like things scampering around behind you in the darkness and stuff. I'm really going mad. Yeah, they'll have things like 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 you'll be able to hear like slight noises and whispers and things scampering around in the darkness behind you. And that and it's even got context interactive noises, which are actually really good. Which also add to it as well. Um, especially like the little cockroach noises I found are actually really good. They're really creepy, the little noises when like you walk over a cockroach and it goes <coughs> You're like, what the fuck? <sighs> Why do the doors have to be so fucking loud? Oh, jeez. That's an annoying thing about the game actually that I found. The they can be bound around the circumference or simply stretched across, tying limbs to the spokes and rim. That's not very nice. All tools are by this point useful, and you may administer the torture in any way you like. But the forte of the wheel is the gaps. When you have decided that the victim shall die, you can smash their limbs with a hammer, making them fold in between the frame. But they'll die. Too quickly, I mean. No, don't worry. The human body is much more resilient. They can survive for days until they finally succumb. Creepy. Ow, bright lights. That's like the only annoying thing about this game is those fucking bright lights. Hang on. Hey, I'm not going too mad anymore. That's that's handy. Ah, fuck that is loud. Close the door. Oh, really? I, 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 I don't need the fucking madness again. Dude. 
Um, right, let's hunt around in here for a uh, orb shard. Ah, orb shard. Yoink. Right, I think there's three of these. Right, okay. Yeah, I know you don't like it in here, Daniel, because you're a big pussy and it was kind of your fault that everything's happened. Uh, Alright, we'll get out of here. Fucking hell, I really don't trust this doorway. <laughs> See, this is where the game's really good. You do not trust anything. Is he out here? I don't know. Right, I think I've got all the bits. I think I've got all the bits out of this place. I think I can safely exit. But I don't know. I uh, I honestly don't have a clue right now. Well, what was that? I know there's a branch just over there. There's a way I can go like left because I came right first. So I'll go left. See what happens. See if I can combine these shards yet. They won't stay together. I'll, I think I need all of them. Alright, okay, let's go. Oh, that fucking dick is around here somewhere. Fucking shaky McStabby. Stop it with the random noises. It's always the little noises that get to you. They make. Oh shit! What was that? Oh, where is he? Oh shit! He's around here somewhere. Where is he? Why am I going mad? What's what's happening? I can't turn my lantern on, he'll fucking find me. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh fuck, where is he? Can I sneak past him? Ah, oh, what's that? I don't like the noises. Oh fuck. Right. Stop it. See, this is the trouble, like, the more your sanity decreases, the more like eerie little noises you'll start to hear because the game like kind of ramps it up the more crazy you are yeah so if your sanity's not where is he? I know he's around here somewhere I fucking heard him oh great that's handy there's nothing down here brilliant I came down here for like no oh it's in the box so I came down here for like no reason then I guess I don't think I can climb that. No, I can't climb it, I don't think. No. I can't climb that. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. We'll just uh, carry on. Stick to the walls, though. Stick to the wall. Stick to the wall. Right. Let's check my... Uh, check my Mentai's one. I spoke of a mixture made with three ingredients. Oh, I Lies scattered in the torture rooms. So, are there any other rooms? I don't know. I'm not entirely sure of the layout of this place. This is a fucking confusing place. What the fuck? Oh, that's messed up. Why do I have things crawling all over my... Oh, oh go, go, go away. Shoo! Shoo! Fucking things. That was disgusting. Right. Fuckers patrolling out here somewhere. Stop it with the random footsteps. Yeah. I think he's at, he's like patrolling around here somewhere, so I've got to be careful. I don't accidentally bump into him like I did last time. There's no way of accurately predicting where these guys are going to pop up though, that's the thing, they just pop up at random pretty much. It's like they do a, um, I think they have like a certain patrol route, but it's not solidly set. And the game will like randomly decide to have them pop up out of nowhere and fuck you up. Go around here. Stick to the wall, see if I can find another torture room. Shit, 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 shit. I hear him, I hear him. Where is he? Oh. 
He's over there. Oh, fuck. 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 Game told me to wait, so I'm waiting. Gotta, gotta play this slow. I'll play this carefully. Gotta be ninja. Gotta be ninja. Where is he? I don't know. Let's go. Ba 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 da da da. Oh, I'm going to have to stop this one in a minute. I'm actually running over time. Uh, let's just see if I can get around here. Stop it with the ominous dooms. Don't, we don't like ominous doom. What's down here? I'm probably going to like a giant fucking circle. It's just, uh... What was that? Oh, man. Oh, I see. This is the other side of that, um... This is the other side of that little chasm. Oh, I see. Okay, okay. That's the other side of that little chasm. Right, 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 right. Okay. Okie dokie. Maybe there's something... Fuck's sake. Maybe there's something down here. I really should take the time to improve my sanity, but I really can't be bothered. Oh! I see lights. Lights are good. Be uh, a bit cautious about this though, because I did hear him down here. Where is he? Come, 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 come. Oh, it's so loud! Oh, close the door up. Oh, I'm in the way. There we go. <laughs> Alright, we're going to have a jump scare in this room as well, or is this. Okay, it's it's a cow. Uh, oh, it's a, oh, fuck, fuck, fuck! It's a cutscene. I was like, oh, I really don't want to touch it. Uh, I think of the brass ball. Just forced to enter it. Always oh, one of those things. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Well, now what? Or is this just like a useless room to enter? Let's light it, see what happens. Oh. Oops. Maybe I probably shouldn't have done that. Oh, I probably shouldn't have done that. Uh, might have been a bad idea. Yeah. Yeah. Can I open it? No, I can't. I've pissed something off because the room's shaking again. Well, that's a fucking useless room. This is... Can I get down here? I don't think so. Oh, it's a tinderbox there. Eh? Oh. Got sketchy for a moment there. Uh, yeah. Tinderbox. I don't think there's anything else in this room to grab. It doesn't look like there's an ore piece in here. I don't think there is an ore piece in here. Stop it. Whee. Okay, right. Yeah, so, uh... Oh, I'm just going to stand here next to this, and we're going to stop this episode here because I'm, a I'm actually running a little bit over. So, this has been Amnesia The Dark Descent. I've been cracking it. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Leave a comment if you've got suggestions on where to go next. Uh, why not subscribe and join the Brotherhood of Legends today. Thank you very much for watching and enjoy life.